everyone welcome back to another video i want to keep this intro short because i am so excited so welcome to another wednesday update today we have some new horses coming to the game we have a new horse breed called the Jorvik wild horse this is not to be confused with the magical horses now in star stables news they explain about the difference between the Jorvik wild horse and Jorvik magical horse it might be a little bit hard for us older players to understand you know that the Jorvik wild horse isn't the magical ones anymore but basically the old Jorvik wild horses which are now the Jorvik magical horses all have special names which I will have put on the screen somewhere in this little introduction but basically the Jorvik wild horses have come for some place in Mistfall and uh, they are the oldest breed living on Jorvik, something like that. You can read all about them yourselves on the Star Stable website or on the screen right now. But uh, we're just gonna end that here and uh, we're now gonna go check out the new horses. So I decided to do an intro here in Valedale Lake because it would be less crowded than down at Valedale Village which is where three of the four horses are. There is one in Fort Pinta just like always. So if you are level one and have enough star coins you can still go and purchase this beautiful new horse and let me tell you I am so excited. I am so excited right now. So Valedale has got a little bit of a makeover at the place where you buy the horses as well. So we're gonna go check that out and I think that I'm gonna buy them all. Right, I'm not really sure what it's gonna look like. Oh, here it is. So is there like, oh gosh, why do we get lag spy? Because there's so many people, that's why. So here are all the old horses. Here we have the Irish cobs. And where are the new horses? I'm assuming they're gonna be over here. Oh my gosh, there's so many people. <gasps> there's so many people here. Oh gosh, is this is this one to buy? Yes, it is. Okay, let me try and get to the button. Here we go. If I click escape and the photo mode quick enough we can get a closer look look at this mane look at that animation what a beautiful face she's pulling look oh my god look at the ears they're so pretty look at like i love the dark outline and the little bit of fur coming off them and look the horses have eyelashes look at them eyelashes so cute and look at how fluffy they look. It looks so fluffy. Oh gosh. I actually, I don't usually like Palominos, but this horse is an exception. This is a gorgeous Palomino. And we're going to check out all these two as well. This one is probably one of, this one's probably my favorite over here. The brown one over here um, from this batch. And this uh gray one over here has the blue so these horses cost 975 star coins they do tolerate the cold which is very good and they have three hairstyles special manes and they have two special moves so guys 975 star coins is pretty good for this awesome horse i don't have a name for this horse either so i'm gonna quickly uh look for a name like i always have to i'm sorry but I'm just scrolling through the list. And is there not princess as a first name or prince? What is this star stable? What? <gasps> I'm shocked. Are you kidding me? Is, I swear there's princess as a second name and not as a first. This is ridiculous. Oh, this is ridiculous. <gasps> How is princess not a first name? I'm gonna be honest, I'm really struggling with names right now. I've been scrolling through the internet for a while and I just don't know what to do. I've got no idea. Oh my gosh. You know what? I usually don't do this, but I think that I'm gonna try just finding a nice Jorvik name first. And if I don't think of a nickname, then you guys can let me know some nickname ideas in the comments below. Right, so I'm thinking the name Wild Princess because I look at this horse and I'm seeing like her eyes and they seem like super posh, you know, but super kind. Like she's kind but princessy in a way, like a wild princess. I'm not really sure, but we're going to go with Wild Princess. I haven't come up with a nickname yet, so if you guys have any ideas, then let me know in the comments below. Ready for it, ready for it, ready for it. <gasps> Your new horse is now in your stable. Thank you so much, little Victory Rhea. And we're gonna go back to my home stable and get on the horse to like, kind of like, oh gosh, look at the gates first and then we'll be back to buy the rest of them. Oh gosh, spoilers, 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 cover my eyes. 
All right, let's go ahead and find Prince Everdream. What's wrong with your face? <gasps> My poor Everdream. Please, okay. <gasps> Everdream's okay. It's okay. We're okay. Oh my gosh, where is she? <gasps> there she is. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh, I'm so excited. <gasps> I usually am not a fan of like the Irish cop and stuff, but like these horses are so cute. I want to pat. Let me pat you. Let me pat you, princess. There we go. Okay, we're not lined up, but that's fine. <gasps> so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, I should actually grab my tack. All right, there we go. I've grabbed my tack. Let's just go ahead and chuck it on her i'm actually kind of interested because it looks like her feet are completely fluffy so can she wear leg wraps no she cannot that's all right that's all right oh my gosh she's so pretty okay we're gonna go outside oh oh i'm <gasps> the trot looks so bouncy oh my gosh i know some people don't like bouncy trots but i think they're kind of cute all right i'm going over here oh look at the little trot she looks so fancy she looks so fancy the walk is so cute i'm um, okay this might seem a little weird right now but i'm zooming into the butt look at the little details down here she's got little freckles along her along her back and stuff and oh look how pretty she's so fluffy look at the ears i absolutely love the ears and how fluffy they are let's look at the canter super cute super cute nothing too special but i love it i love the mane and how the forelock goes to the side all right let's go gallop it's a nice gallop pretty standard gallop full gallop okay i do like it i think it looks very cute so let's see the jump oh i liked the jump it's very it's very like nice <laughs> i don't know how to describe it oh it's really cute okay okay are you guys ready i'm hitting the space bar i'm hitting the space bar oh oh my gosh look at us on the horse look at us on the horse lying down <gasps> look at us oh my gosh you guys you guys <gasps> It's kind of sad that, oh my gosh, it's so cute. It's kind of sad that this is just a special move and that it doesn't last a while, that like lying your horse down still isn't something that you can do um, with any horse all the time. Like if you just wanna lie on the ground for a while, you can't just do that. But um, it's super cute, I really like it. And um, we haven't checked out the special gate yet. So you just have to be walking and then you hold shift and then you press up like you're going to the next one. Oh, look at it, it's dancing, it's doing a little dance. So this is the thing that we saw in the water um, in the trailer. It's super cute, I think it looks super cool. And oh, it goes for a while, oh, this is fun. It goes for a while, oh, it's, it's not like a special move. Your horse will keep doing this as long as you um, make sure it doesn't flash red. So you just have to slow down and then speed up again and you're fine. Oh, it's super cute. Okay, and I was looking at the idle animation and they looked super pretty as well. Super cute. So now we're going to go back to Veildale and actually look at the main styles and buy the other horses there. Which means I'm going to have to struggle with names again, you guys. I'm going to have to struggle with names again. Honestly, I love this horse. I love this horse so much. It's so pretty. I'm getting just like a little bit of lag, so I'm sorry about that. It's just because there's so many people here. There always is when there's new horses, but I hope this is all right. We're not doing too badly. So let's look at the main styles. So we have one main style here, which is like a little bit of a beard and then the spiky hair. And we have this one here where it's super fluffy. Oh my gosh, it's so fluffy, I'm going to die. But I think that Miss Wild Princess here is going to keep uh, this main, my main style here. <gasps> Look at the mane in the trot and how it's like wiggling. Oh my gosh, why is that so cute to me? So I'm gonna buy this horse next because um, as I was in the trailer, I came up with a name for this horse. And I came up with the name Jack Frost and I'm gonna call him Ice Boy. <laughs> Please tell me Ice is a name. Yes, okay, Ice. And is Boy a name? Oh my gosh, is Boy if Boy isn't a name? My entire life. Okay, good. Ice Boy. Let's buy Ice Boy. Jack Frost. Oh, I hate and love my names at the same time. We have a Jack Frost with his little blue mane and tail. Super cute. 
love it. There's not much I can say about the animations on each horse, but I do love the coats of all of these horses. When the Mawaris came out, I felt that Star Stable had gone very basic on the coat, but maybe Mawari coats in real, li in, in real leaf in real life are just very basic. But um, I think that Star Stable's really like being very creative with these horses and I really am enjoying the coats. All right, we're taking Jack Frost to get his hair done. I kind of want to put him in the spiky mane. Super fluffy is actually like, I expected them to put more blue down the bottom. <gasps> he actually looks so cute as super fluffy Jack Frost. <gasps> I'm torn between doing this one and super fluffy Jack Frost. Oh, I kind of want to do super fluffy Jack Frost. Oh, I'm torn, you guys. I am actually, yeah, I'm going to do super fluffy Jack Frost. I wanted to have like one of each mane style but i think that this fluffy neck one is so cute and it matches him so good i love this on him and i think that i can work with the blue i wear a lot of blue anyway so i think that it'll work <gasps> super fluffy jack frost my heart now we're buying the last horse here which is the palomino and i don't know oh we didn't do a victory rear it's okay it's okay victory rears aren't important this palomino is so pretty bumble bumble's kind of cute <gasps> please tell me bumble's a second name no <laughs> i wanted to do honey bumble oh <laughs> Oh, I wanted to do Honey Bumble. I'm sad now. I'm sad. I think that Honey is a cute name, so I'm going to do Honey something. You know what? I'm going to call her Honey Chunk. I don't really have a name for this horse. I'll probably call her Honey or something. Hun. Ew. I don't know. Okay. But Honey Chunk. There we go. Super cute. Palomino. Honey Chunk my baby she looks so cute i'm gonna go and look at the different main styles on her we might end up liking the the little short one but i do actually really like the long main hairstyle as well which for like the 100th whoops 100th time in this video is my own personal opinion let me know what you guys think in the comments below she is so cute i love honey chunk all right, so here we have Honey Chunk and her different manes. We have this super fluff, the little spiky one. I actually really like this tail style. I think it's super pretty. And, um, but I kind of wish you could choose it separately to the mane. And, um, I just don't think that Honey Chunk suits it. I really like Jack Frost with the spiky one, but I loved the fluffy neck one more. This fluffy neck one is also super adorable on this horse, but I think I'm going to keep her hairstyle the same. And of course you guys can also switch between all the hairstyles that are available here, including their normal one. Oh gosh, I tried to jump and it didn't work. I think that girl just did the same thing as me. <laughs> So we are now heading over to Fort Pinta to check out the final horse color, which is the one that we first saw in the sneak peeks on Instagram. Okay, so there's not as many people over here. This horse isn't getting enough love. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. This one's super cute. I don't usually like the black and brown type of horses, but this one's kind of cute. So we're going to buy this one too. Okay, this is probably a bad name, but I'm calling this horse Red Lion. I don't have a nickname for it once again, but basically, like, its eyes are red, so it's kind of evil, and I'm going to put the fluffy mane on it, I think, so it's going to be like a lion. I don't know if that's a bad name, but Red Lion, there we go. It's done. We've just bought all of the wild horses. All right, here we have Red Lion. He's super cute. I think that I'm going to turn off my character just because... A lot of people compare the horse with what the character looks like on it and we already know that we're going to be getting a character update at some point so I think that when the characters get updated um, they will look better on the horses so I think that right now we really just need to focus on the horse but we're going to go check out the main styles on this horse, Red Lion. I don't think I can explain to you how cute I think these horses are. I think the animations are super cute. And although they're like draft type horses, like look how cute this little trot is. I think it's adorable. And um, I just think that they're done really well. Like maybe that's just my own. It's definitely my own opinion. And you guys are allowed to disagree with me. But I think that the Star Stable team has once again done a great job. 
I'm sorry to go on a little rant, but I know that a lot of people haven't liked some of the past horses, which is completely your own opinion, but I think that the past few horses that Star Stable has made have been amazing. So here's the super fluffy mane. Oh my gosh, it's actually so cute on this horse. And here's a little spiky mane on this horse. We can try and get a different angle. Fluffy, spiky. The spiky is actually really cute. I am going to get the fluffy mane on this horse so that he can live up to lion. And um, I do actually really like the normal mane style too though. <gasps> Look how fluffy his belly is. Oh my gosh, imagine like... He him like kind of rolling over when he's lying down just scratching his belly oh my gosh i don't know if horses like that but like super cute <gasps> so cute oh my gosh i cannot believe that this is something that we have in the game now he is so fluffy i'm going to die look at him run like a beast he's so cute He's like my little teddy bear lion. He's like trying to be strong, but he's just a little sweetheart. All right, you guys, so that is all of the horses. We have now bought them all, and I'm gonna do a little quick montage of them all and just all their goat gates and so you guys can see what they look like in the game and maybe decide if you want to buy one. So after that, I'll be right back with you guys for the outro. <laughs> Start a fight, never know who's wrong or right Feel nothing when you go I know it's not intelligent Drinking for the hell of it But that's irrelevant now We should talk about with us How come we're holding on? Cause really I don't see the benefits now And you're broken my trust So I just wonder Why do I fall back to you? Really nothing I can do about it Why do I fall back to you? It's like you're a drug to me I can't quit it's not like we're still 22 Trying something new, just a pastime I don't think that we ever could work this out None of it makes sense, there's no reason why Why I still fall back to you Alright you guys, so that is the end of this video. Just a few things that I wanted to point out that I forgot to mention before is that we forgot to look at the rear and it's actually really cute. I really- oops, lost, no one saw that, no one saw- it's fine. Um, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's just cute. I kind of like it. It's probably not my favorite rear that's in the game, but that's okay. And that animation right there, that is so cute. How they like scratch themselves. So cute. Oh gosh, there was more stuff that I wanted to say, but I completely forget what it is. So I noticed one thing when I was uh, testing out this move right here. Um, look at this. So, uh, yeah, this horse just has, like, some really great butt strength or something. But, yeah, it can spin. I feel like I don't talk enough about the horses, but um, I actually love them so much. Like, I feel like I haven't critiqued them enough, reviewed them enough for you guys. But, in all honesty, I love them, and I think they're so cute. Look at the fluff. Just look at the fluff. And the last thing that I wanted to speak about was look at the nose, like when you're riding, oh gosh, bad examples, bad examples, the nose like flares and stuff, you can't really notice it on this horse, but the the nose and the snout, I think it's called the nuzzle, has animations to it and it flares, which I think is super cute. Also the ears, look at how the ears wave in the wind, I think that is the cutest thing ever and I think it's such a small detail but it really like, it really enhances the horse. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you want to see more of the horses, then make sure to subscribe because I will be riding these horses in my videos and I will be doing some training times with these horses. So make sure you subscribe for that. Look at the tongue. Oh my gosh, the tongue. <gasps> the tongue. <gasps> my gosh, this horse has such good animations. I'm in love, Star Stable. You did such a good job. 
thank you so much for making this awesome horse for us but if you did enjoy the video then make sure to give it a like and uh, subscribe because those are both free ways of supporting me and also leave a comment down below if you like these horses and which one is your favorite or if you're waiting for the second batch to come out before you make a decision but I hope you guys are having an awesome day or have had an awesome day and I will see you guys in my next video thank you all so much for watching this video and always supporting me I love you all so much thank you so much for watching bye